What's up YouTube? It is Epic Games TV and we are back again for some more testing of our Conquest Survival Plus pack. And well, we kind of jumped ahead a little bit on our town storage building. Now the reason for that, let me just jump up here real quick. Also did a little bit of road work. I'm not 100% sure if I like this, uh, this look, but we're going to try it out. But uh, let me show you what we did. So there is our storage building. Now I realized when we were doing the last video, I did kind of like a long play version. And well, I didn't know exactly how to build the building. Wasn't sure what kind of wood to do for the second floor, all that kind of stuff. So it took a long time to build it. So I guess in future episodes, I'm gonna have to either stick to the same style of building and uh it will speed up the building process so i do like the roof now the problem is the roof requires a lot of hay bales to uh to craft it so it takes a long time to make this kind of stuff but what i'm going to do in this episode is i kind of want to kind of well i've already started it i want to build sort of like a gatehouse like a little tower and I think I'm going to adjust this so there's an entrance up here. So I'm going to, uh-oh. I hear him. I just don't know where he is. Well, maybe he's inside. He's probably inside. Let's take a peek. Is he in this one? No. Nope. Is he in this one? Oh, and you know what? Maybe he's down here. Yeah, I think he's right there. Let's go take care of him. We don't need any zombies interfering with us. So anyways, getting back to what I was saying, I'm going to make this into a gatehouse. So the idea is basically... I'm going to put a house on top of that and then we're going to have the wall come down this way and probably come down along here and we're going to put a little wall probably kind of similar to this style of wall not like a castle wall but just big enough to kind of help protect the people and uh, we'll bring it down this way and we got to start building some other houses so we might just stick to the same style of this house Oh yeah, starting to rain. And our poor golem is getting beat up. I wonder if we could feed him some iron. If that would uh, fix him a little bit. Let's give ourselves a couple pieces of iron and see if that actually works. I can't remember if this works or not. I don't know if it's a vanilla thing or a modded thing. It is a vanilla thing, I guess, because we were able to repair him. Okay, we're gonna sleep, push on the night. And uh, I'll put this back up in there. Now, before we uh, get to building that structure, I'll take you inside here because I spent a lot of time figuring out what I was gonna do. So this part is really easy. It's just a bunch of chest. And then we need the lectern. And then we use this and now it is a storage. So that's all set up. So the only thing we're missing is to get our, our uh, total hearts up to 400. We're sitting at 75 right now, but we're set up. And I, I think this is pretty good. Maybe we'll put a little picture or something up here. Add a little decorations. And I need to get some more wool. We uh, did this. Now we can dye these another color. But uh, we put all this up. This is all just oak. And then inside here, we did some more decorating. Like so. 
and then I need to get some ladders because what we're gonna do is we're gonna basically make this a way up to kind of like an attic storage area I don't know what we're gonna do maybe we can put a couple more beds up there um, and they can uh, have some people sleeping in the attic and stuff so this could turn out to be like an extra little house but yeah this is the storage room so far and maybe a little coat rack right here I think I still have oh no I only had two of them and I used them there okay so what I want to do is I guess I need to fix the hole I put in here so let's put that in there and that in there and we're gonna get rid of well actually we could probably just leave that in there so I want to make this kind of a curved entryway So first things first, let's grab, do I have some cobble on me? I have some different type of cobble. I don't think that's the one we want to use. Um, do I have, it doesn't look like we do. We're going to have to go digging again. Okay. So we're going to do kind of like a curved entryway so we kind of want to go I guess this direction um, I don't remember how wide that is I think it's five wide so we probably need ten of those and then I'm gonna need Some of these, if we want to texture it a bit, and I'm also going to need some roof ones, kind of like this. Okay, let's see if we can make this rounded. So the idea is basically we're going to put one there, one there, and then we're going to use the roof ones here. You know, we could probably just get away with, uh, do we get away with that or do I want to go all the way down? Let's see, Let's see how that looks. Well, it's definitely rounded up there, but I think I want to go like that. Now, the other option is we could bring it out. So if I was going to make this a gate, I probably, if I was going to make this a gate. I probably want this to be where stuff comes down right which means we would probably want it in here and we really could just have a door right there going into the building and then maybe we want a window or do we want to bring it a little further back and we could put an arrow slit. Maybe that's what we'll do. We'll put an arrow slit on either side here. That might be a good idea. And then we'll just bring this a little further down. Okay, so we're going to put a door there. Let's take that one out. And I need to take this out. And I think, you know what? Maybe we should stick to that. 
Let's go this way. Then we'll put stairs here. Let's put this back up. And then that will be the way the gate closes. And then up in that room, we're going to probably want to make some sort of like mechanical, mechanical thing. So first off, I believe it's four wide. And I need one of these for a door. So that can probably be our door. And then I need two arrow slits. Where are my arrow slits? Right here. I need two of those. So there's my two arrow slits. And then I need some stairs. We need like four of them. And I think that will cover us for what we're gonna do. So we'll start off with the arrow slits. We're going to go one there. And well, I guess I need to bake, make a little hole in here. So we have some arrow slits. That's good. And then we're going to go, I guess, oops, not like that. But we're going to put these stairs in here. Um, like that. Let's do one more. Let's bring this back down. that there and I'm kind of thinking I just want to keep one side closed so only one side is actually replace that so we don't see the dirt there we go and uh, we'll have one side be the way up but we also wanted to put a doorway in here so we'll put that in there and then we'll put a door here that will make it look nice. And then we can take this out. Fill this all in. Perfect. And then we can take this out. I think I lost one of my torches there. Yeah. I did. Um, gate comes down there, so we could probably leave a torch like that. And then on this side, we kind of want to have the same thing. Oh, that's not it. Did it go in here? I've lost my, oh, it's actually right here. I was going to say, I lost the curves. I'm going to go one here, one there. Would this look kind of weird on the bottom, maybe? Yeah, that would look too weird. And then we need the roofs again, one here. Perfect. Let me just see. We could just make this whole thing look really nice. Like so. And then two here, two there, two here, two there. Then we'll switch to this side. You're going to need some more of these, I think. Whoops. Wrong one. Okay, we have the arrow slit there, which is okay. 
and then we'll go like that. Um, maybe we'll change this. Looks like we might have lost that stuff. Okay, it looks like we lost it. But that's not bad. We'll have to do one more level of stone up there. Get some sleep here. And I'm gonna have to go chop down some oak again. Since we're gonna keep to that style, do I have any oak here? Can we make sticks out of this? Let's see here. Oops, wrong thing. We can make six out of it. Perfect. Let's go like that. Get some ladders. And then let's go over here. Um, I've still got some thatch. Still have some chests, but I think the main amount of our oak because I don't have enough of this stuff yeah we're gonna have to wow do I have a lot of oak stairs let's just double check over here oh we do have some more oak okay I need to figure out how big of a spot we need And I need to take this down. So do I have an axe? I do have this kind of an axe. Don't know if it works. Oh, it is going to work. Okay. And then I want a ladder. And I think what I'll do is we're just going to put the ladder straight here. And we want to go one more higher. We want to go one more higher. Or do we want to just have. No, we'll go one more higher. So it looks uniform. Uh-oh, we ran out. Uh, I've got enough of that, so that will work. We'll use this. There we go. And then here... We did get those... Um, fences. I only have three here, but I do have some fences in there. I got one. The only problem is getting this stuff out... I think that's the other thing we're going to have to look at is a better backpack mod. Okay, so we have four. So basically one, two, three, four. And that's essentially going to be our gate. And then we could have this a little higher to kind of help it look like it's actually falling down or going down. And then over here, you know what? Let's bring this out a little bit too. 
Um, I've got that. So we could go one up here. And let's bring this out a little bit so it looks a little bigger. And I don't have the other stuff to go through the side wall, so I'm going to have to wait. And then we're going to need... How many of these? How big is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So it's fourteen long. So that means I need twenty eight, and then one, two, three. Maybe we'll go we'll go out on each side here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's 12. Okay, so we need about 40 pieces. And we need to work on some food because that's my last piece of bread. Day 23 of summer, I need to harvest all that wheat. Now, I can't remember, did we use... Let's do that. Let's go like that. And then let's take all those. And then let's go like this. And like this. We'll do a little extra. Then I think I have... Maybe we don't have any extra. Uh, we won't worry about the angle ones. I've got seven extra right there. So that takes care of that stuff. Um, I do need some more cobblestone. And I'm definitely going to have to do some mining for cobblestone again. Let's put that up there. Okay, we'll put the dirt, more dirt. Okay, I need two more of these. And then I need a whole bunch of these. And we'll try that. We'll see how far we can get. Do I still have some oak logs? I do. Okay. First off, we'll work on the bottom. Actually, you know what? We could... Could just go like this, too. Probably would make it look nice. And then we'll go like that. We'll give this some texture. Bring it out a little bit. not bad now I don't have enough to do the backside because well I didn't think about I need another ladder there we go and since we're doing this we uh, probably I'll swap that stuff out one, two, three, four. 
Oh, that's weird. What block? Oh, that's definitely weird. One, two, three, four. I'm kind of wondering, one, two, three, if we should take this out. I guess so, right? Okay. And then we're going to go fill that in. Like so. We kind of want to have some windows. We're going to go across here. Across there. We'll do the same thing on this one. And then we've got this section here. We really could just do a big window right there. And that will be... Yeah, that will work. And then on the sides, we're not going to have any hangover. Now, I do want one piece here. And then I guess like that, right? But uh, remember where our logs are. I'm going to go across here. And the log will be there. So we'll take that one out. And that one out. That one and that one. And we'll take that out. Looks pretty good. And then we'll have to figure out what we're going to do for the sides. But these are pretty easy. They go like this. Two, three. And then across. Like so. I probably should go sleep to uh, help deal with the monsters. But I also want to get some of this building done. There we go. And then I got to figure out what we're going to do with this. We could put a side window. Or we could just leave it completely filled in. With maybe a small window up top. So if we were going to do completely filled in, go like that, I don't want to fall down there. And then let's put, yeah, I think that will work really well. And we ran out. Yeah, I think that's going to work out really well. Let's go back in here. Let's get our uh, spear ready. Because you never know where something's going to spawn. Make sure the uh, general population is safe. Looks like everybody's safe. I don't see any spawns right now. Moon's up. Oh, there's one right there. I do like the glowing eyes. kind of hoping for a creeper because I want to test if the creeper will blow up the ground. 
but I'm not really seeing any creepers. And this area might be too lit up. I hear something. Oh, spider. You can hear it coming out of the ground. But you have no idea where these things are spawning, which makes this game a lot more interesting when you can't look at your mini map and go, oh, that's where they are. There's got to be something over here. Maybe we're not going to find any creepers. Okay. Well, we'll sleep through the day. We'll get back to building. quickly run back to our house over here. Excuse me, sir. Okay, there are some zombies. But I don't see any... I don't know what that was up there. What we're looking for is potentially a creeper. Another zombie. If we could get a creeper to chase us, that would be really good. It's so hard to see any mobs. Oh, something died over here. Yeah, I'm not seeing any creepers, so maybe we can't. Something. Oh, scared me. Where is he? Oh, there's a creeper. Okay, technically. Technically, this should be the protected area. Okay, so he didn't blow up. That's good. He didn't blow up our area. Man, that one skeleton scared the you know what out of me. I'm sure you saw it in the video. It's kind of funny. Okay, so we know that the uh, protection is working on our buildings. Let's get back to uh, doing this. So we need four curves. So we'll go back over here. Um, I don't think we need any more of that. So let's put this away for now. Oh, actually, we do need some of that. So we need four curves. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to need some more of these. That should be enough. One there, one 
there. And then one there. Let's get the rest of this fixed up. Okay, yeah, that one's good. This is a little off. But I think we're going to take this out, right? But I think I'm going to leave that one. So if that's the case, uh, is that a full? That might be a full. Let's go here. Okay, that's good. And then I need to do one in that corner. And then that will cover all the bottom. We need one here. And then we'll probably have to take... Well, there's nothing growing in that one, so that's okay. Okay, so there we go. So now I need four, eight, uh, 16, 16 more logs. Then we can uh, kind of get to the roof section. Okay, we need to go chop down some trees, which gives me the opportunity to go test out our um i put in a new a new mod to basically help with chopping trees actually i need that still Let's get rid of all this stuff here I'm trying to downsize okay that's kind of downsized a bit and give me a couple of those. Actually, let's do one more. We definitely need... Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh. That stuff doesn't work. That will work though. Okay, let's see if this works because we um, we added a tree falling type mod. Should make the tree fall. There we go. Perfect. Um, I don't know what happened with that tree. Be gonna be kind of weird having it fall up top, but I think this mod's gonna work out really well. Oh, that was weird. I think the uh, isn't the uh, branches in the way. The only thing I noticed is why is this not uh taking any durability or is it no it's not taking any durability I'll have to look at that See if we can get some uh, trees back down in here and regrown before the uh, season changes. Uh, we could probably put one right there. How many 
logs we got? Quite a few already. This one. There's a tree there again. That one tree uh, popped up really quick. Okay, that should cover us for a little bit here. Uh, almost four stacks. It's plenty to get what we need to get done. Must be a very cold day here. Put all these saplings up there. Um, where do we put the ladders? I'm going to need these ladders to kind of help us fill in the gaps up here. Because what we could do, oh, I got rid of the other one. That's too bad. Well, let's go do these anyways. One here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And of course, this is where I'm going to get stuck. One, two, three. Oh, no, I won't get stuck. Okay, and then we need a way in and out of this side, too. So let's go like this. So now we have a way in and out on both sides. And I forgot the other blocks. Now we just have to do the roof and then we'll add some of our extra beams and stuff like that. And we'll have our gatehouse. I'm going to have to get some more glass. Okay, let's I think we have uh, some wood in here. Let's put this stuff in here. I don't think I need that anymore. Now we need, uh, not like that, sorry. We need that. Then I also need, uh, what's that, four? So 16 in the front and 16 on the side, 32. Can you do it this way? It would be so nice. No, it would be nice if you could um, do this. Where you take the bark basically off. Let's put it over here. So we're gonna need all this. I wonder if this is a northern hemisphere type thing where 
which is why we're getting all this frost. This shouldn't be elevation. We're only at 67. This is all frost on the ground, which is kind of weird. And I did go look at the config files for the fabric version of season, and I didn't see a way to kind of adjust it. Okay, so this requires... So I'm going to need eight of these. One for each corner. Oh, no, wait, we need them all. Yeah, we need them all. Okay, and then this one here. Um, what are we looking for? I'm not seeing. Small window. I'm not seeing what I'm looking for. Okay, let's make our door. Because I'm definitely going to need the door. Go over here with our door. We went with a round entrance. Not the big doors. I think just, uh, oh, we could do spiked iron gate. Wonder how big that is. I guess I just need these heavy doors. We're only going to need one. And what am I going to do with that? Uh, I guess we're going to need to make dirt, dirt pile again. So the easiest thing to do would be, I guess, that one, maybe uh, right here. Then we're going to go up there, like so. And then we're going to go along here. Our lovely dirt bridge. We'll go all the way down to the other side. Okay, that's as far as we need to go. And then we'll go up like that. We'll do this one. This one and now I've got some for the front we still have the oh we got rid of the ladders let's just make a little step ladder going up there we go then let's do the same thing on here so not that one but we want this one and that's that's high enough, right? I sort of messed that up. There we go. That's definitely high enough. And then let's go bring our dirt ladder or our dirt bridge this way. off this side and 
all I'm doing is right clicking that one extra time to change the block state. Okay, so there's all that stuff. So that's looking a little bit better. Then we have our door that we need right there. So there's the doorway. We got our arrow slits. Um, I think I want to come down one more with the fence. So we'll see if we can make some more oak fences. I am going to have to deal with, with all this though, because one, we are out of food. And I got rid of the other mod we were using that was basically making us have seeds on us. That was just too much. All we want to be able to do is right click our crops. Which reminds me, I need to look for a way to prevent guys from trampling our crops. all grown over here so let's collect all this also collect all the wheat that we're collecting let's hope that this grows up pretty quickly again oh I forgot this section over here okay well we got a ton of seeds we can easily plant more um, and I do need some more food kiwi crops are working on right click that's good that's croptoria right yeah and that's candlelight so does this work that's working also I'm just making sure that since we changed the right clicking that it is working on other things Potatoes are working. And uh, cucumber, carrots. Okay, it looks like most of the stuff is all working for the right clicking. That is going to be really nice. I do need to make, we'll just make this for bread for now. And then we'll make this into hay. And uh, where's the other one? Fourteen more hay barrel, hay bells. Um, I need this stuff out. make some room here uh, that can go that can go that can go that can go oh oh that's a rare dude oh that was a rare dude that almost killed us Look at that, half a heart. Riot shield, unbreaking five, protection three. Kind of a weird shield to be, uh, to be using, but. Hey, it gives us more protection. 
kind of looks like a door. Definitely weird. Okay, let's go here. Oh, it makes you go walk slower. Did you notice that? Oh, and you can't use it while holding the spear. Minus two armor when in offhand. Minus four max health. Minus 20% speed. That's not exactly the best shield, guys. Let's, let's put that away. Let's take that off. Okay, we're going to go back up top. But I do need these ladders. And we're going to need, going to need some slabs. Now let's see, do we want to do slabs? Yeah, let's do slabs. Just do a whole bunch like that. And then I'm going to show you how I do my roof. Oh, you know what we need? I do need some other things first. Hold on. Is it going to rain again? I don't know if that is enough. gonna take that whole thing because we're gonna use a ton of this so even if I have lots left over so that will go in there and then first off let's fill this stuff in Prevent ourselves from falling in. And we could actually take this out and make it stone. I don't have any on me, but we could just make the stone slabs to keep it all the same look. And then we want this. Now we're going to keep the ladder there. So. We'll have to fill that in, which is fine because we only actually had the window on the one spot. And then we're going to allow this to go up like that. And hopefully, hopefully that's going to work. Now this roof is a little smaller. So I have to think about this. If we are coming out here, Oh, shoot. That's going to change. It's going to change like that. Um, I think I did this differently. I think we, uh, no, I think we'll be okay. like that. No, nope, it's going to cause a problem. Um, we are going to have to think about how we're going to do this. there and then that one there and then if 
Um, half slab. No. This is the part that I always get confused on. Because what we're going to do... I think I need to actually replace... I think it's like this. Because I think this goes out on that side. And that one goes up there. That one goes right there. That one goes right there. Oh, we messed up already. Yeah, that's not supposed to be there yet. We need to go... Let's take this one out. Fortunately, I lost it. This has to go that way. And then on top of it, it goes like this. And then on top of that, we go like that. And then we go like that. Let's fill this all in up to there. And here, here, I think. And then that goes right there. Now, are we center? No, we've got to go one more. So center would need this right there. And maybe like that. And that would be... No, I did it again. This goes here. That goes there. That goes there. And then this goes there. rest of these and we can save ourselves a little bit with that and then that goes like that that is our roof design that goes like that that goes like that that goes like that like that and then this is like a little half slab something like that anyways and then this would be like so and then another one up here and like so another one up like that See if I did that right. That there, that there, that there. And then just temporarily put that there. Okay, that should be the roof except for the very top and I might want to actually let's get these half slabs going in here side okay it somewhat works we're 
definitely not going to get this finished today. But you guys will have a basic idea of how we're building the buildings. I probably don't have any torches on me. Nope. Okay, so I want to take this out with put it with cobble, same with this. And then we're gonna bring this up a little bit. And then I gotta figure out we do have create. Um more for some other purposes, but we could we could use like this hand crank. Mixed in with something like the cogwheel to kind of make it look like we're crank, you can crank it up. Maybe even this thing here, this display board, that you're actually like cranking up the gate. Or we can make it so this side is the one that cranks up the gate. Like put a belt. Yeah, we could probably put a belt here and as you crank it, the gate goes up. I don't know if we can actually make an actual gate. We'll have to try that later on. But you guys are getting the idea of the building. I'm going to quickly sleep. And then we'll uh, apparently... Apparently one of my guys is being attacked. I hear him. Did we not sleep? Yeah, there we go. Oh, see, look at these guys. I see you. I see you trying to sneak in. Uh-oh. We're on fire. Okay, relatively safe now that's the basis of the roof now we do have to add a few things to that so maybe I can do that before we go hopefully have enough dirt it's probably easier if I just run up here Take advantage of. Yeah, I think it's okay for her, like right along here. Okay, so that's got to go there. got to go there and I got to get one way up there so if I if I put this here that get me high enough there it does okay that one's there that one's there I think that's good except for we do it that way Think like that, okay. Now we'll uh, clear this out. We're just going to check from the side here. Oops. 
to put that tree in the way. Yeah, I think that's going to be fine. I think that roof's going to work. And then we'll have to do some trim and stuff on this side. It's looking kind of plain. And then um, we'll continue. We'll continue the uh, the wall this direction. I think that would be good. Yeah, nice. I think that's going to uh, work out really well. So I'll finish the roof off stream so you guys don't have to watch it. It's not like I'm streaming it, but we'll uh, we'll finish the roof because that's kind of going to be a little boring. Um, the only thing I'm going to add to the roof is some half slabs just going across the top beam. We could put a little fireplace in there to help keep them warm. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Yeah, we'll put a little fireplace, nothing fancy. Um, a little bit more fencing and then we need to get some glass. So I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me just eat some food real quick. There we go. Get our health back. And uh, yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think? I'll take a picture of it. We'll use it as a thumbnail for uh, that building. At least you can uh, see what we did, what it looks like when it's finished. Um, I won't do the decorations on the inside yet I still want to kind of figure out if we can automate the gate going up and down because that would be really cool yeah look at that we are becoming architects who needs mine colonies right when we can just build it ourselves <laughs> I do love my mine colonies so okay let's give you guys your ultra secret backflip there we go Woo! you do know that we can do a front flip right Look at that. And we have some uh, fancy dancing. Look at that. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Epic Games TV, and we are out of here. Take care, folks.